what is up guys so um coming to you with another new video finally about time i know uh as you can see from the title i am making curry chicken and rice today uh i don't know when this video is gonna be out but today is august 6th which is jamaican independence day i'm not jamaican but you know fun stuff so i was feeling the vibe so we're gonna make some curry chicken so if you want to see how i make curry chicken just keep on watching okay so as you can see i got a red and green i have to say apple <laughs> uh bell pepper I have an onion and then i have three potatoes so i am going to get my knife and start cutting i'm going to start with the peppers they'll be the easiest i'm only going to use half of each pepper so about half i'm going to use that slide that there and then that that's there and then onion there that's done so i'm gonna um wrap these up really quick these ones that i'm not using so i could just have what i need right here all right so they're all washed off I'm just gonna cut them. I'm gonna dice them up. So I'm gonna cut them long ways first. I didn't mention that I have my rice on here boiling. I got my, oh, okay. I have my seasonings. I got some Larry's seasoned salt, garlic salt, um, some Cajun spice, salt, pepper, and then my curry. And then this is my potatoes, my onions, and then my peppers. Okay, so I seasoned the chicken with the stuff I showed you. And I just put the peppers and onions in here. So that's what it's looking like. And um, let me take you over to the stove. So I have um, my pot here. Um, and I have it on like, I'm gonna put it on like medium. And I just have some vegetable oil in there. It's about a half, I would say like a half, maybe like a quarter cup of vegetable oil. And I'm just letting that heat up real quick. I'm gonna sit you guys down. All right, sit you there. Can't really see that much, but um, letting that heat up. And then I'm gonna pour the curry in there so the curry cooks before um, it needs to cook. The curry needs to cook before the chicken. as much curry as you prefer.
All right, now I'm gonna take my uh, spoon and spoon out all the rest of the peppers and onions. I'm just gonna leave it like this and on four like I said it is 459 so I'm gonna put a lid on it and then we'll see how it goes before I go I do want to mention that I mixed it up so it is all combined and everything and I turned it back up to five um, so I'm about to put the lid on it now and let it cook. Okay, so it's 6.37. I'm checking on the chicken. i just been letting it cook this whole time. It looks amazing. It smells even better. So, I'm just gonna look. I turned it, um, or I already had it on. This. Oh my goodness. But yeah, it's still on five. I'm gonna let it cook until probably about seven and then I'm gonna make, this is my rice by the way. And then I'm going to make um, some cornbread. Cause I want some cornbread with it. So, uh, so yeah. Just added potatoes. Final result. 